it was a, a year of SAG strike. At that stage of the game, you did not have SAG-AFTRA. You had SAG. And there was a SAG strike, which we went to SAG. I remember these meetings, and we said, look, we know what you're trying to do, and you're not hurting the networks. You're hurting the academy. Don't do this. Well, sorry, we're going to do it. So we had two AFTRA members, Dick Clark and Steve Allen, who could do that because they weren't crossing the SAG mm -hmm. picket line, and so they were our hosts that year. And one after another after another performer award was accepted by the Academy on behalf of the recipient. So was there anyone in the audience? So the audience was full, but it was full of executives <laughs> and people who were okay to be there. Um, so now we get to toward the end of the show, and it's the award for lead actor in a miniseries or a special. The Jim Jones story, the, you know, mm -hmm. the, the the horrible Guyana tragedy story. And the star of that, playing Jim Jones, was Powers Booth. And so the envelope is opened, and, the window, and Powers Booth, and all of a sudden, here comes Powers Booth. Back from the lobby at the Pasadena Civic and down the aisle, and everybody was like, good Lord. And I think he said something, this could be a horrible mistake, but uh, I really feel that this is something that, you know, uh, I, I, should, I should be here and I should get this award and I appreciate it. Thank you, Academy, et cetera. And then he, he went off. Years later, his wife ca came. I, I think that he, at this stage of the game, he was, he was ailing a bit. And his wife came and she had the original Emmy and it had fallen off shelf or got knocked, knocked over in an earthquake or something. Mm -hmm. And it was, you know, torn up and whatever. So I fixed it for her. And um, I said, can you tell me what that day was like? What happened that day? How, how does... She said, well, she said, he had gone to the laundromat. And he was to... This was day, days when people actually went to <laughs> laundromat. And... Or, or the laundry. And he, you know, he called me up and he said, you know, I earned that nomination. It was a horrible part. I worked like crazy and I you know I, I just sort of think that this is not right and it's not right for the Academy it's not right for me and I don't think that this is going to make a big difference to the Guild and I frankly think that this is something that I should do so he came to the Emmy Awards and he got his Emmy Award